Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Platinum, and in this episode, we are going to take on the next member of the Elite Four, who uses Psychic-type Pokemon. Now, our only Ghost-type is currently what? And pretty much the only person on our team that can use attacks to defeat Psychic-types. However, Watt is not very fast, so I honestly do not know how this is going to go, man. I've been dreading this for pretty much the entire playthrough, but the time has finally come to take on Lucian. God dang it, man. Ah, uh, you timed your arrival well. I've just finished reading a book, you see. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Lucian. I am a user of the psychic type, I must say. You've already proven yourself to be outstanding by coming this far. They say I am the toughest of the Elite Four. I'm afraid I will have to go all out against you to live up to that reputation. Yeah, could you maybe just go a little bit easier on me? Yes, just like Will from the second generation. Lucian has only psychic type Pokemon. He does not mess around except for his first Pokemon, which is just Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime really isn't here to do a ton of damage. Sure, it has Psychic, but mainly it's just here to be a wall, and oh boy, he's not being nice. So it's going for the light screen first, which is going to completely wall off this Shadow Ball. Oh man, it's gonna do next to no damage. Let's try another one, and he's going for Psychic. Okay, this shouldn't do too much damage, but at the same time, I think we might have to use, oh my gosh. All right, this is automatically just not looking good at all. Oh god, okay, okay, okay. Maybe this will knock him into the red or get the special defense draw. Okay, so we're both dropped our special de- I see, I don't know if my special defense dropped or not, but maybe, maybe, despite the light screen, we can get another attack going. I think this will have to be the battle where I actually use a hyper potion, because, uh, I'm, I don't know, man. This is looking pretty- That wasn't even a crit, what the heck? Okay, we're not, we're not fast for sure. The psychic might not be able to KO me, though. I th should live in the red. Oh my gosh, well this is looking absolutely terrible. I didn't even know if that would KO me. Okay, it's fine though, we can persevere. I'm gonna send in Cross, because the Leaf Blade should be enough damage to KO this Pokemon. Let's hope. Psychic will also pretty much not do a ton. It's going to be neutral, which I'm totally cool with. And yeah, that knew any, that totally did any damage. Now, the Reflect isn't up, and short, oh nice. And shortly, the Light Screen should fall so maybe, yeah, it flew off this turn. Okay, next up is Espeon. Without a doubt, his toughest Pokemon. <sighs> I'm not sure what we should do here, man. Okay, so I know for a fact Espeon has Psychic and Shadow Ball, which is why he's sending it in against Cross, because that will be super effective against me. But, and also a Signal Beam. I think I can wall it off with Kink. Now, sure, we're not gonna be super fast, but a Surf from an Empoleon, is gonna pretty much do damage to everything on his team. So let's give this a shot. It's level 55. It'd be fantastic if we can outspeed, but I really doubt that's gonna happen. Psychic should be resisted. It's still gonna do a ton, but it's resisted damage. And oh, never mind. It did not do a ton of damage, and we did not get the special defense increase. I'm all about that. Maybe Surf can two-hit KO. Without a doubt, this is his most deadly Pokemon. Oh my gosh, I think we're I think we're getting somewhere. Just don't crit. Just don't crit. Just don't stick. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. Okay. That is really, really good for me. That is definitely his strongest Pokemon. And we just KO'd it because King is a tanky King Penguin. Okay, Emperor Penguin. Whatever. I don't care. Next up is Gallade. Gallade, as we've seen many times before, is weak to fly type moves. Now, I don't have Air Slash on Alucard, but it'll do just the same with an Aerial Ace. We don't even need a Swords Dance. This might be a two-hit KO, because Gallade just don't got the best special defense, or normal defenses. Aerial Ace, we are faster. That's really good, too. Hopefully, we can do this. Now, I say Gallade is... Wow. That's a lot of damage. He will use his berry, but that's fine. That's more than I could have ever won. Dang, that's Skyblade helping out, dude. Psycho Cut, though, as long as it does not crit. And don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Just stop. Just oh my gosh. Okay, sweet. So luckily for me, his berry did put him back into yellow HP. So Lucian's AI will not make him heal his Pokemon up to full, which I'm totally cool with. Okay, this battle, despite the fact that we did lose what? is going okay. Um, I'm gonna try and defeat this Bronzong with Krom. 
Now, my mentality is here that even if it switches out into something else, I'm still going to get my Swords Dance off, and I can probably tank at least one Psychic. I'm hoping that's the case. And went for Earthquake. Ugh, God dang it, I forgot I had that. Okay, maybe we can live. Just maybe. Maybe. Oh my gosh. Okay, so sweet. This close combat should do enough damage. We are plus two in attack. We got a lot of attack. It's a stab move for crying out loud. Everything is on our <laughs> on our side. We got a fist plate too. And okay. And we got a crit. Okay, that's really, really lucky. <sighs> now that his bronzong is gone, he only has one Pokemon left. Hopefully, we can take this thing down. It's Alakazam, everybody. Alakazam, as you all probably know or don't know, is my favorite Pokemon. And as a result, I know exactly how deadly this thing is. It has Psychic, Dark Pulse, I'm pretty sure, and Focus Blast, which is the only special physical attack, <laughs> fighting type move, other than Aura Sphere. I am going to have to heal King up if we're going to take this thing down. Not as deadly as this Espeon, in my opinion, just because it doesn't have access to Shadow Ball, I want to say. I don't, honestly don't remember the move sets, but if we can get the Quick Claw to proc against this thing, or if it misses its Focus Blast, we can KO it with Surf. So let's just pray. Focus Blast is going to connect. Oh gosh, this is really, really bad. Uh, okay, okay, okay. We might be able to tank it. I know it's a really strong attack from a really strong Pokemon, Oh my gosh, okay. This is all this is all we needed. Now, I am an idiot and just did lose one of our fastest Pokemon, but maybe there's someone else on our team that's fast enough to take this thing down. I'm just gonna stay in and surf because yeah, he will go for the full restore. So now he's out of healing items indefinitely. Now we don't have any priority and I don't know who's faster than Alakazam because Alakazam is one of the fastest Pokemon, if memory serves me right, on the psychic side of things. And Okay. Gosh, I'm really regretting getting rid of Aqua Jet. Oh my god, dude. The Quick Claws have been saving me so much. Okay. And with that, Lucian has been defeated. And all of the Elite Four has gone down to the King. I see. You've gotten past the three before was no flu. Yeah, I won. You lost. Congratulations. You've now beaten the Elite Four. However, that doesn't mean you're done with the Pokemon League. There remains the Champion. I should warn you, the champion is far stronger than the Elite Four. Now go on, set through the doorway to your final battle. God dang, dude, I did not even know if I was going to beat that or not. Okay, so one more battle to go. And without a doubt, this is the toughest battle, I'd say, in almost all of Pokemon, just because the champion of Sinnoh is really, really powerful, has Pokemon six levels higher than us, or more. And honestly, we're gonna have to pull out all the stops if we're gonna take them down. Oh god, dude. I don't even know if I'm ready for this. I really hope I am. <laughs> god dang it, dude. But we've come this far. There's been a lot of close calls. We just need to win one more battle. And in the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Platinum, we go against the strongest trainer in all of Sinnoh. Well, other than us. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching, but in the next episode, we end our adventure. So see you guys then. Bye.